Okay, today I'm going to be taking apart this um, portable monitor. It's got just a USB plug, so it plugs in and outputs its video and gets its power from this USB. It's meant to just kind of be on a stand like this. Um, I got this as a gift, it worked really great, uh, but then it stopped working, so I'm going to take it apart and see what's in it. Okay, so we found a few interesting things here. First off is this screen. It's actually much more stiff than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be really flexible. I might just kind of pull this apart later, probably not as part of the video, just to kind of for my own interest see what's in here. Uh, but that's kind of cool. This is a legit, you know, flat panel. You can see how thin they've gotten now these days. So that's pretty cool. The other one is this, I'm calling it this, I don't know, pixel distribution board. You can see these main buses, uh, whichever one I pulled out, I think it was this one, comes into here and distributes so the pixels can get uh, populated throughout the whole monitor. The next one would be this, uh, I don't know what I would call it other than like a signal processing board. So this is where through the USB, a bus came from this board into this board. And this actually somehow decodes the video data and uh, puts it out through to the pixel distribution board. And then of course the USB, so power uh, comes through here. You can see this is a real simple circuit, um, pretty much just uh, what's needed for, I guess this uh, USB handler or UART or whatever that form that comes in. Um, and then the, the connector to get the data out. It's also these interesting metal brackets that were in there. You probably saw me taking those out. Those, are, those seem to like stiffen the structure. I can't remember how these are like that now. Um, yeah, they were just screwed in here, something like that right on this side. Um, but these just screwed in, uh, I think, just to stiffen it and add some weight. Um, and there was a couple of those, so kind of cool. Overall, uh, very similar to any other monitor, but much smaller and simpler. So um, I'll be taking these and putting them in for my circuit board project and kind of a cool deconstruction.